going to show you how to set up alerts for your document libraries using Power Automate. This can be done by creating a custom date column and using Power Automate's templates. To create a date column, click on Add Column, select Date and Time, name your column, we'll call this Due Date. You can leave the settings as is and click on Save. Once this column has been created, you'll see there's a set a reminder and you did option under automate. For testing purposes, we'll add some dates so that once the flow is created, we'll be able to get some notifications. Once the dates are set, we'll click on Automate, click on Set a Reminder, select the date column, and then in this pop-up window, our flow options will appear. All right, so it'll sign us in. If we're not already signed in, we'll click on Continue. You can change the name of the flow if you'd like, and we'll set the number of days we'd like to be reminded of before the due date. For our testing purposes, we'll select three and click on create. So right now our flow has been configured and very soon we'll get an email if uh, one of the dates are within the next three days. Okay, so we've received our email saying that this item is due. We can also make changes to our flow. We'll click on Power Automate, see your flow. You can change the date. You can also delete. You can also make some changes to it as well. So we'll click on our flow. Here we can see our run history. We'll click on edit. And then under the number of days to remind, we can change that from three to something else. Under the rec recurrence option, we can see when and uh, w how many times it's being repeated and you can change that option as well. Okay, to delete the flow, just click on delete and your flow will be deleted. <music>